Oh my God. Welcome back to Big Mouth. I have just seen, and I'm sure you've all seen it a trillion times by now, the Batman teaser from Zack Snyder's Justice League Snyder Cut. Mwah! You do not understand the emotion running through my body, my heart, my soul, my mind right now. That was amazing. Amazing. What I dreamt of when I thought of a Justice League movie as a young boy. Zack Snyder is fucking cinema. Why didn't they let us see this film three or four years ago? Amazing. So you've got this brilliant moment where pretty much Batman's standing on his tank or whatever you want to call it, his new kind of Batmobile, and it's slowly distanced away from him. And you hear all these voices. You hear Harry J. Lennox's voice, a.k.a. Swanwick, a.k.a. the Martian fucking Manhunter. I live on this earth. I should do something to protect it or whatever he says. Right, then this voice says, I've tried hard to keep us apart. Now I've got to get us together. Who is that? Who is saying that? And kind of, is it Superman or is it someone we haven't seen yet? Could it be the Lantern? Wow, how amazing would that be? Um, what does Gal's Wonder Woman say? Hate is a waste of time or something like that. Look, it's the music. Junkies music. Junkies music is amazing. Ben Affleck is the best Batman. He looks in fucking awesome shape, doesn't he? In that teaser as well. The best shape I've ever seen him as Batman. Wow. And Henry Cavill in the black costume. But this is the coup de grace, my friends. Superman. Henry Cavill Superman helping Batman up on whatever they're standing on, right? Them standing together. The fist bump from Ray Fisher's cyborg and the fantastic Irrepressibles, Ezra Miller's The Flash. I like the dynamic between them. I even like the dynamic between them in Justice League. Those two are great. We see them standing there. The music's fantastic. We hear Alfred talking Jeremy Irons, the legend that is Jeremy Irons, a legend playing a fucking legend. The whole thing is sensational. And I mean, I was emotional. Seeing the Hallelujah teaser. I was emotional seeing the first official trailer a couple of weeks ago. And this is what? A 30 second teaser. But the emotion I got from that. Because this is a fucking Justice League movie. In 2021 we are getting an over four hour epic DC movie. A Justice League movie continuing from Man of Steel and BVS. In 2013 you were divided about his vision of Superman. In 2016, you didn't understand what he was trying to say, but in 2021, you will join us under the fucking sun. That's what's going to happen here. Sensational. Um, I just, listen, it's just, look, it's an amazing piece of marketing. Again, all done by Snyder. The guy is a visionary director, writer. He's an artist. Um, and he does marketing too. The man's multi-talented. This is our George Lucas. This is our, not, not my generations because I'm 48, but this is your generation. This is the director everyone's going to remember in 50 fucking years time. Like we remember George Lucas, like we remember Spielberg, because they injected something, imagination into our minds. And this is what Zack Snyder's doing. Now, Zack Snyder is adapting characters that we've known for for generations. But he's doing it with verve, panache, originality. This is the very fabric that we don't have in our industry right now. We are full of creators and directors that are too busy going on Twitter telling us how kind they are and how they're on the right side of the political history. No one gives a fuck, right? Nobody cares. All we care about is that you can get in our hearts through your art. And Zack Snyder doesn't go on Twitter boring on about his politics or how he supports women because he supports women. He supports everyone. He supports suicide prevention. He's a great guy who's gone through so much. But this, I mean, look, I've been excited since the announcement. As you know, I broke the fucking Justice League Blu-ray in front of you. Really, I should have used it as bog roll, um, but I don't think I could have done that. <laughs> I couldn't have done that. <laughs> I couldn't have done that on a freaking 
uh, YouTube video, but I'm buzzing, I'm talking nonsense, but it really is amazing. So my excitement levels were up here before, before I saw this teaser. Now they're fucking up here, baby, because that was sensational. As I say, I can de decipher most of the voices in, in that um, teaser on what they're saying. I can't remember what everyone had to say. But that moment, that voice, as I said before, that says, I spent a lot of time get, driving us apart, but now I'm, I must get us all together. Again, I'm not sure who that is. Is that Batman? The, the voice just doesn't sound familiar to me. So that's pretty awesome. But all the dialogue is brilliant. The music is on point. It just feels like a teaser to the best superhero movie we're ever going to freaking see. Do you remember that time David Ayer wore a certain t-shirt and it said, fuck Marvel, fuck Marvel, embrace DC. That's what I say. Sorry, Marvel fans. I've got all your films in my uh, cupboard there. I like them. But, you know, oh, yeah, and then um, Robert Downey Jr. and somebody else had a T-shirt saying, fuck DC. Well, a reasonable reaction to that. But at the end of the day, we're here to stay. And Zack Snyder is our driver. There will be a Justice League 2. There will be more. This film will blow up. I promise you of that. Um, a 10 out of 10 teaser, as I say, beautiful marketing. It was sensational. We will talk more about this teaser um, in the, well, remember, there's there will, I don't know if it's uploaded yet, but there will be um, today's edition of the DCEU Daily uploading with this um, video. This video will probably upload first because it's going to be a shorter one and the DCEU Daily soon after. But in the next DCEU Daily, uh, I recall, we will react properly to this teaser. I can't get my mind right, but it was freaking sensational and I am buzzing. Let me know what you thought of this piece of perfection that confirms that Zack Snyder is DC. Zack Snyder is cinema. Comment down below, comment down below, like, share and subscribe. And I'll be back later on with the DCEU Daily. See you again soon.